What's up, YouTube? So today I'm going to be talking about Hispanic Heritage Month. Um, I didn't know this was happening, but, uh, you know, I'm kind of glad it is so I could, I'm going to draw awareness to it, to all the raza, all the Mexicanos, all the Mexican-Americans, or whatever you call yourself, Chicano, whatever you call yourself, you're Mexican. All right, so I'm going to address this for the raza, um, and what I think about it, pretty much. This is my thought, you don't have to agree, you can disagree, you can think of whatever you want. So let's get started. First things first, just the term Hispanic, it's like calling a black person the N-word. So it'll be the N-word heritage month. That's disrespectful. Hispanic, we're not Hispanics. Hispanics are white people from Spain. We don't even speak Spanish the way they speak it in Spain. Our, our, our Spanish is mixed with the Nahuatl language from the, you know, from the Aztecs, from the Mexica. We don't even speak the Spanish that they do. Um, not only that, you know, Hispanic was, you know, I've mentioned in many of my videos, um, it's calling someone a spick. It's what our people, when Zapata was with the Revolucion, the Spaniards used to call the, the mestizos, us. We're mestizos. They used to enslave our people. They used to call them Hispanic to insult them. It just feels like being Mexican ain't good enough. So we have to be labeled something else, something that we're not. You know, um, so I, I, I do I do feel a need to address this. I probably will address it in, a, in a, at the school. I will bring it up wherever I see that sign. I'm going to bring it up. I'm going to bring some awareness to it. Um, but yeah, we're not Hispanic and we're not Latinos. Latinos are white people from Spain. We're not white people from Spain. We don't speak that Spanish and we're not white. We're Mexicanos, we're Mestizos, we're mixed. We are part indigenous and part Spaniard, or you want to call it European, fine. We have two bloodlines in us. That's why when I get son, and you put a, a European uh, male next to me, and we both get son, we're going to look completely different. I'm going to look Mexican, he's not. He's still going to look European, because we're not European. Our features are different, because of our, our indigenous bloodline. You see? Um, but yeah, I do find the term Hispanic Heritage Month to be insulting. Because that's what we were called when our people were enslaved by the Spaniards. Hispanics. Spics. So, like I said, it's like calling N Heritage Month. You you know, I'm pretty sure the black community wouldn't, wouldn't appreciate that. I don't understand why the raza tolerates this. You know, Hispanic is a, it's a slave term. It's, it's, it's a slave. It's a... Uh, it's a racist term, but uh, you know I don't I don't blame the rasa. A lot of us are not educated. A lot of us don't know. A lot of us are just eat what they give us and think that they do all the homework for us. They don't. I see a lot of uh, they're really trying to break you away from your culture, saying that you know oh Mexicans not a race. It's, it's it's a uh, it's a nationality. No, it's not. You know, no, it's not. And then then being a United States an American is that that's not a race. That's a nationality. The real American, the real people that came with that idea were the people from England. You know, but um, that's besides the point. The point I'm trying to make is that, yeah, hi hi uh, Hispanic Heritage Month. I get the good intentions that it has, but it's, it's so watered down that we can't even promote who we are no more. You got Europeans getting upset we have our flags. They get upset we speak in Spanish. So what are you, what is her, what is the heritage, the ones that the Europeans want you to have, or are we are we allowed, or are we gonna stand up and actually represent who we really are, and not identify as Hispanic or Latinos? I know a lot of people, you know, are not educated and they call themselves Hispanics and Latinos. They don't. I'm gonna assume they don't know their history, and if they do, they're just being ignorant. They're just going with the flow. Don't care. That it doesn't matter. And that's why, you know, you call a European Anglo-Saxon, some don't like it. We're the only race that doesn't have a color. Everybody else is white, black. We should just be brown. Just put black, brown, brown, brown pride, brown heritage uh, man. You know? Or Mexican-American. Or, if, you know, if you want to label everybody in South, call it South America Heritage Month. And not Hispanic and not Latino. Let's call it South America Heritage Month. That includes Mexico and everything from the South. You see? Um, 
But that's all I have for this video. I think I am going to address it. I am going to go up to wherever I see the sign. It could be a school, a library, whatever. I'm going to address it. Someone needs to say something. I think that someone's going to be me. You know, I, I, you know, I don't want to live my life thinking, you know, I should have done this. I should have done that. I'm just going to do it. You know, I, I do role model after, you know, Zapata and Pancho Villa. Those are, my, those are what I call my role models. And you have to be a stand-up type of man to, to speak up. You know, now, you know, speaking up is... It's prohibited, you know, oh, don't say things like that. No, we need to speak the truth. Stop sugarcoating and say how it is. If people don't like it, that's a personal issue. But with that being said, I wish you guys a good day. God bless each and every single one of you. Um, I wish all your dreams, all your ambitions, everything that you want to do come true. And have a great day, man.